This is fresh basil. basil I'm going to make some pesto so I've already cleaned these I washed these I'm going to separate them like I separated these most people will throw away the flowers these are the flowers you can eat these there's nothing wrong with these flowers I'm going to use the flowers as well Fresh basil is all clean. Got it from the farmer's market. I'm gonna put a little bit of Himalayan salt. These are my Brazilian nuts. I have olive oil. I have olive oil already in my blender. And I'm also gonna use fresh garlic from the ground. This is fresh from the farmer's market. When I say this garlic is fresh, super fresh. Okay, once again, my ingredients was Himalayan salt, Brazilian nuts, basil fresh garlic you can also use parmesan i'm not using parmesan cheese in mine but you can put parmesan and if you don't have brazilian nuts um actually you can use pine nuts but pine nuts um i didn't have any and plus they're a little more expensive um so i'm going to now blend this up and then i'm going to add my fresh basil to add my fresh basil in here and I am making a pesto sauce adding my fresh basil in here and once again fresh basil Brazilian nuts Himalayan salt fresh garlic okay you can put it in the processor if you want only thing like I said I'm not putting um, I'm not going to put Parmesan in mines. olive oil in here I don't want to mess up my blender so to start adding there we'll continue to blend Y'all see that? The only thing I didn't add was Parmesan cheese. Um, add Parmesan cheese and it gives it that um, that rich flavor. But it's already rich and good because I put garlic. But um, you can also put Parmesan cheese. And this is my homemade pesto. And I have my, have my little mason jar to put it in. Store it in the refrigerator. I got my own pesto. I don't have to go to the store and buy that $10, $8 pesto. This didn't really cost much. Okay. okay, here's my perfect pesto. 
anything the store got you can make remember that anything the store have you can make it at home homemade fresh cheaper to make okay be blessed i'm gonna put it in my jar homemade pesto made by me a jar like this will cost you about ten dollars in 2021 in these stores uh-huh it's cheaper to make anything at home you go to an Italian restaurant, they may, not all, but the majority, they charge you $2 for a teaspoon of pesto to go with your bread that they done gave you, free with your olive oil and vinaigrette. Once again, my ingredients, fresh basil, fresh garlic, Himalayan salt, Brazilian nuts, but like I say, you can use pine nuts as well in olive oil. Parmesan cheese is one of the ingredients, but there's no Parmesan cheese in here. There's no additive. All ingredients are fresh from the farmer's market, except for the Himalayan salt, olive oil, and Brazilian nuts. The rest of the ingredients are from the farmer's market, but all my other ingredients are natural. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you for taking out the time. I appreciate it very much try this recipe and let me know but you might want to add parmesan cheese i just didn't have any parmesan cheese but you can add parmesan cheese into your pesto okay be blessed and god bless you i love y'all